This week on DevKit Weekly, we're going to be reviewing and raffling the Korea KR260 Robotic Starter Kit from AMD Xilinx. Despite being the scary stuff of movies for a while, robotics technologies have been rising in popularity across fields from industrial to medical and even consumer for years. When you're operating in factory environments, robotics and automation technologies can be especially useful for maximizing efficiency and flexibility. And that's precisely what the Korea KR260 Robotic Starter Kit from AMD Xilinx was designed for. The Korea KR260 Kit, designed as a development platform for Korea K26 SOMs, is built around the EV variant of the Zinc Ultrascale Plus MP SoC, which includes a quad-core ARM Cortex-A53 and dual-core ARM Cortex-R5F, and blends real-time control with soft and hard engines for waveform, video, graphics, and packet processing. All of the Zinc Ultrascale Plus MP SoC devices also include a 16 nanometer FinFET Plus programmable logic, but what sets the EV variants apart is the inclusion of an H.264 and H.265 video codec, which is capable of simultaneous encode and decode up to 4K resolution at 60 frames per second. It's also worth noting that alongside that video codec is an ARM Mali 400 MP2 graphics processing unit. But back to the kit itself. One of the main highlights of this starter kit is the flexibility you get from programmability. It features 256,000 system logic cells and 1.2,000 DSP slices, alongside 144 block RAM block and an additional 64 ultra RAM block. There's also 4 gigabytes of non-ECC DDR4 memory, 512 megabytes of QSPY that functions as the device's primary boot memory, and an SDHC card for secondary boot memory. This kit is an instant-on robotics platform that features deterministic communication across internal networks and uses the open-source Korea Robotics stack to enable ROS2 hardware accelerated packages. You'll also be able to leverage the kit's time-sensitive networking capabilities via two available TSN ports with built-in switches and time synchronization via ethernet connection, which also supports converged data types and traffic classes. As if that wasn't enough, the starter kit also includes features like an SLVS EC sensor RX connector, an SFP plus cage for 10 gigabit ethernet vision, partner IP, and low latency lightweight ISP, all to enable high performance machine vision capabilities. Now, of course, when you're working in industrial and automation settings, security is a primary concern, which the Korea KR260 starter kit addresses with the use of the Zinc Ultrascale Plus MPSOC hardware's root of trust technology for secure boot, as well as Infineon's TPM 2.0 to support measured boot. The kit is also rife with interface connectors, expansion headers, and other I.O. options, such as included RJ45 Ethernet ports, Wi-Fi adapters, and the PMOD ecosystem that all enable sensor and network connectivity. While the kit doesn't have a wide operating temperature range, 0 degrees Celsius to 35 degrees Celsius, it does include a heat sink and fan to help regulate its temperature. The Korea KR260 robotic starter kit is centered around ROS2, an open source suite of middleware for robotic software development but it also makes use of the capabilities found in Xilinx's Vitus Vision Library and Vivado Design Suite for machine learning application development. In a nutshell, the Korea KR260 Robotics Starter Kit has a lot of elements, functions, and features that make it an excellent tool for roboticists and embedded developers to prototype robotics and industrial automation and control applications. If you're interested in getting one yourself, they are available on Xilinx's website for $349. Of course, if you'd rather save the money, you can also enter this week's raffle linked on screen now and in the description below for a chance to win this starter kit here for free. That's it for this week, so as always, thank you for watching, good luck in the raffle, and we'll see you on the next episode of DevKit Weekly. For more content from embedded computing design, including behind the scenes footage, raffles, giveaways, and just cool stuff that we're doing in general, visit us on social at the links provided in the bio below.